As we look ahead to the new year, the Senate Republican Caucus remains committed to passing a balanced constitutional state budget and fundamental reforms that will put our state back on track. It's the way to bring back jobs, predictability, and prosperity to Illinois. Our caucus has a few more ideas about how we can make Illinois a better place in 2016. I'm looking forward to working with the governor's office and my colleagues on both sides of the aisle to, uh, to bring new uh, innovation to Illinois, to try to bring private sector capital into Illinois. We need property tax relief. We need uh, to have term limits. We need legislative remapping, not drawn by politicians, but by citizens who look out for the interest of the entire state. I hope the General Assembly will take the time, and I certainly will work on things like education funding reform, workers' comp reform, really changing the direction of Illinois that encourages businesses to come to Illinois and to stay in Illinois. I'm looking forward to 2016 being a year where uh, Illinois really starts to recover economically and we see jobs coming back, we see people getting back to work. I'm really focused on job growth. As we know, there's so many people in need in our communities. Uh, our efforts to change our state with regard to being one of the most effective uh, business incubators uh, in our country, we really understand that's important about how it affects families and what we have to do as legislators to make sure we're business friendly. Outside of talking about a budget, which obviously everybody wants to see happen, um, have been working for several years on ensuring that Illinois can become part of the compact licensure uh, group. I will continue to advocate for our veterans and our kids in our schools. In 2016, my New Year's resolution is to continue to help our students connect with our employees for jobs in the district. We've worked a lot this year on the education funding proposal that will really rewrite the way in which Illinois distributes its funds to eight or nine hundred different school systems. It's been a big effort. We've lined up lots of co-sponsors. I look forward to working across both sides of the aisle next year uh, to get that legislation passed. We've suffered from 12 long years of no positive reform and year in and year out of overspending what the taxpayers could afford to send to Springfield and it's time to change that and we are going to continue into 2016 that battle. From the Senate Republican Caucus I want to wish you and your family a happy and healthy new year.